Nobody wants the ball when the show and the Ravagers get together. All right, this time in Oakland for Sunday Night Football. There you see the AFC West standings for the second year in a row. Nobody going to finish the season with a losing record. We are 8-6. and six. They are 9-5. and five. Coming out in the Las Vegas Outlaws-inspired alternate uniforms. Ravagers going with the all-white alternates. And the guys looking good. Fired up. Nice uniform gain here under the lights in Oakland, California. As Mike McMahon stepping in for Mike Vick. On third and nine finds Reggie Wayne. And it's a first down for the show. Can Rudy Johnson get the running together? Not on that one. Loss of two, second and 12. And McMahon goes down. Sack, third down and 18. And that one nearly intercepted. McMahon, four interceptions in the last game when he had to come in in relief as Favre goes down. Ebenezer Ekubon with the sack. Okay, over the middle to the rookie tight end, Jason Randall. Third down and five. Favre going to the left and it's batted out of the air by Jeremetrius Butler. Three and out go the Ravagers. Look out. McMahon brought down again, another sack, second down and 20. Plenty of time over the middle and it's nearly picked off. Third down and 20, over the middle and this time it is picked off. Napoleon Harris had an interception in the last game two weeks ago, as, far, as well as a scoop and score touchdown. And he's got a pick in this one. Fumble, picked up by the defense. Keith Newman's got it, and he's brought down from behind past the 46-yard line. Ravagers challenge. Norv Turner throwing the challenge flag, and for good reason. Uh... Yes, uh, overturned as the ground causes the fumble. Jason Randall playing fullback. And he's brought down for a loss. Third down and nine. Gets that off somehow. And Rod Smith comes up with it. First and goal. Ravagers. Outside could really use that pick there. But it falls incomplete. Picked off at the goal line by Nick Barnett. Vegas able to force the turnover after all. But we start at our own two-yard line. Rudy Johnson up the middle, making a little bit of room. Going to Rudy again, and he's clipped down. No gain. Third down and seven. Throwing from the end zone, and it's nearly intercepted again. Now punting from the end zone. Brian Mormon going to get off a butte, going to get caught at the 45. Fumble! Dante Hall muffs it. But we can't come up with it. Ravagers start at about midfield. This place second and nine. Outside falls incomplete. Third down and nine. Favre's pass to Randall short of the line to gain. Punt the ball back to the show. And it was a touchback. And Quan Bolden with the catch. And here comes the show. Bolden over the middle again, and we're near midfield. Look at McMahon dealing after the interception. Caught! Lance Moore! And the show inside the Ravagers 30-yard line ends the quarter scoreless. Here we go. Second down and 10. Outside. All right. Take the underneath route to Rudy Johnson. We're inside the 25. Third down and five. Play action pass. Backpedaling and oh, can't connect it was there and man those ravengers alternate whites looking pretty good uh janikowski from 40 yards out is good it is three nothing show okay we're trying to get the audibles we want the defensive ends rushing the passer and i accidentally did the corner and troy brown is going to be wide open and going to score from 80 yards all-time bonehead play by me. We're hanging around in this one. And then a mistake like that that's easily preventable is going to freaking cost us. Not to mention that sack. Second down and 18. And uh, surprising, really, I didn't just turn off the game at that point. Like Snoop Dogg on the Manning cast. Third down and 18. And we got it. Don't turn it off, baby. And Quan Bolden with the conversion on third and 18. 
Second down and 10 over the middle to James McKnight. And it's good for our, or no, it's third and inches. Play action, McMahon on the run, not quite Vic, and we throw it out of bounds. Fourth and inches, lined up to go for it. Quarterback sneak, and it's the best run of the day by far, as McMahon easily gets it. Six yards on the quarterback sneak. Rolling out, finds Anquan Bolden inside the 35. And off to Rudy Johnson, and he's got eight yards on the carry. My goodness, that never happens. Second down and two. Over the middle to Anquan Bolden. Uh, Vegas to the 16-yard line. We're going on first and 10 outside to Reggie Wayne. And it's caught inside the five. First and goal. Play action. Scrambling. Backpedaling. And finds Rudy Johnson down to the one-yard line. Second and goal. Quarterback sneak. Can't get it. Third and goal. Quarterback sneak. Nowhere to go. Fourth and goal, two minute warning. Quarterback sneak, in! Touchdown show! My goodness, finally gets in. And it's 10 to seven with less than two minutes to go in the half. Second down and six, Brett Favre. Going to the Pro Bowl, has his pass batted down. Third down and six. Outside to the rookie, Nehemiah Glover. And it's a first down. Glover again with the catch. And here comes the Ravagers. Favre in a heavy traffic throws that one and it falls incomplete. Intended for his Packers teammate Donald Driver. Third and one, Clinton Portis easily gets it. And the Ravagers are across midfield, but not for long. The loss there puts him back towards the 50. Less than a minute to go. Over the middle and it's picked off! by Julian Peterson, awakened with JP. And the Ravagers struggling to hold on to the ball in this one. Thank goodness for that. All right, we can't get the handoff. Goes for a big loss. Second and 15, the pitch out to Chris Brown. Ravagers electing not to call timeouts. We can run this thing down to the half. And Vegas looking to pull off the major upset and stay alive! Fumble! Recovered by the defense! John Thornton with the sack! Him and Favre having some words. And Vegas gets the recovery at the 19-yard line. And off to Rudy Johnson, only good for two yards. Second down and eight. Going to Rudy again, and he breaks free. Gets us down to the 10-yard line. It's third and inches. The quarterback sneak fumbles. And, the and we got it back! Fumbleitis, the turnovers. That's why we call this turnover central two. My goodness, two turnovers on one play. Backpedaling, back, 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 back. And the receivers can't get open. We throw it out of bounds, second and goal. Nowhere for Rudy Johnson to go on that one. Third and goal at the 10. McMahon rolling out to the right. And it's not looking good. They call that an incomplete pass. Janikowski from 27 yards out is good. And it is 13 to 7 Vegas with five minutes to go in the third quarter. Up top to Donald Driver. What a catch. And the Ravager is above the 35-yard line. Favre. That one hits Julian Peterson in the back of the head. Favre. Outside to Troy Brown, but it's only good for a yard. Third down and nine. And it's a sack! John Thornton, sack number two. Fourth down and 15. Bring out the punting unit. Mitch Berg gonna drop this one at the 30. Lance Moore off the leg. Recovered by the defense. Mike Caldwell's gonna take it into the end zone. Another bonehead play. We're hanging around with these guys, if not for the enormous mistakes. We would be up 13 to nothing without those. And then, of course, the near interceptions that can't catch. Second down and 10. And Quan Bolden with a catch. And we are behind by one. Finds the tight end, Pro Bowl tight end, Jeremy Shockey. And we're up to the 45-yard line. Outside to Rudy Johnson, a uh, minimal gain, two yards, second down and eight. The pitch out to Chris Brown, looking to turn the corner, gets to the 50. It's going to be third down and five. 
McMahon. Gets that off to Anquan Bolden. Good for a first down show in a Ravagers territory. We're not gonna give up. Jeremy Shockey going to the Pro Bowl. Makes the catch. It's a first down. Chris Brown nowhere to go on that one. Second down and 11. Play action runs and it goes down as an incomplete pass. Third down and 11. Under pressure again. Throws it away and they're going to call it intentional grounding. Drive ends with a punt. Get it to the 12-yard line and not for long as Randall with the catch over the middle ends the third quarter. 14 to 13. We're hanging around but the all-time big mistakes are costing us. Rod Smith with the big run. Ravagers above the 35-yard line. Up top to Donald Driver. And they're to the Vegas 42. Favre. Outside to Driver again. They're to the 32. Throwing on second and 10. And that's caught by Rod Smith. And now the Ravager offense getting hot. Third down and two. Going over the middle to Troy Brown. Gets him to the seven-yard line as first and goal. Favre over to Rod Smith. Down to the two-yard line. Second and goal. The handoff to Clinton Portis. Dives to the goal line. And that looked way too easy. Flexes on us. Takes a bow. Get out the clown wigs. It's 21-13. to 13. Can Mike McMahon and crew get this thing downfield? Second down and 10. Over the middle to Jeremy Shockey. Takes a big hit. It's going to bring up third down and five. McMahon is nearly intercepted. That happens like half the time. A three and out. Give the Ravagers the ball back. The rookie tight end, Jason Randall, having a day. Clinton Portis not going to get enough for the first. It's third down and one. Play action outside to Troy Brown. Caught at the 36-yard line. This play second and seven. Blown up by Jeff Albrecht. We call our second timeout. Third down and 11. Randall nowhere to go. And we call our final timeout. Give us the ball back with two minutes and 19 seconds to go. And we're getting sacked and injured. McMahon injures his elbow on the play. Done for the game. Should be good to go next week. Second and long. We trot out the rookie Derek Anderson out of Oregon State to try to lead us on a comeback. Third down and 19, and missing the first two throws. Fourth down and 19, play action, and sacked. That was the play that got us the tie in the last one. And they don't take knees. Instead, they run with Clinton Portis, and it's a nine-yard touchdown run. Takes a bow, and we get the sick cinematic replay. Thanks, guys. 28 to 13. Can we have the rookie complete some passes? Rookie to rookie, there's Lance Moore with the catch. Going deep downfield. Caught! Lance Moore, rookie to rookie. Gets us to the 26-yard line. Can we find the end zone? Flips this one out, and it falls incomplete. Eight seconds on the clock. Play action. The same play against Pittsburgh last week, but the Ravagers able to cover it up. Let's try it again with three seconds on the clock. Play action. Deep downfield for more, and the Ravagers play it much better than the Stiffs a week ago. 28 to 13. Ravagers sweep the season series like we did to them last year. And it's not looking good as Vegas has lost five of their last six games. We fall to eight and seven. Seven turnovers in this one. There were seven turnovers in the last one two weeks ago. We had the possession time. We we're slaughtering it there. But the mistakes killed us. Uh, McMahon, a solid game actually, 17 of 32. With only the one interception, Favre two picks. Clinton Portis, 10 carries, 21 yards. It's tough to run in this thing. Rudy Johnson, two yards a carry. Chris Brown, three yards a carry. Not good. And Quan Bolden, seven catches for 82 yards. The best receiver of the day. And Troy Brown, actually the best overall receiver of the day. Four catches, 101 yards, and that gift. Mike Caldwell gets to be the player of the game with the fumble recovery. Taiwan Joseph, a touchdown in Dallas' win. Washington using three quarterbacks. 
Denver wins to get to 9-6. and six. That doesn't help us out at all. Brooklyn beats San Diego, who's on a free fall. That doesn't help us all out at all. And we'll finish the year against the fleet. We're going to need a lot of help and a win to possibly make a playoff spot. We're not out of it yet, but realistically, the Brawlers and the Crush have some easy games in a week 17. We don't. <laughs> all right, guys. Let me know your thoughts on this game down in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next show.